Okay, uh, hi, this is Jay. Uh, here we got a, just a quick little comparison video here uh, between a couple of sabers, uh, just to show different uh, brightness and effects here that we have. Uh, this is uh, brass saber number 12 that uh, came back for a uh, soundboard upgrade uh, from the uh, original board that was in it to a uh, uh, Petit Crouton 1.6. Uh, the brass saber number one here is running a crystal shard. Um, now, the LEDs, which is what this is, uh, video is really for, is uh, uh, to show the difference between the uh, Luxion V, which is in uh, Brass Saber 12, and a Tri Rebel. Uh, this is as a green, green, white. And this crystal shard is set up to run a uh, flash on clash or clash flash setup. Uh, with the the, uh, the two greens obviously light up the blade, and the, uh, the white will flash. Uh, the Lux V obviously does not do that either. So uh, let's uh, start these up. We'll see how bright they are. Uh, I think the uh, Lux V is still going to be slightly brighter. Uh, the LED settings on these are both about the same. This one actually does not have a setting for the LED. Uh, they said to be used the uh, resistor. This has a 4.8 volt battery pack. It's fully charged. This has a uh, 7.4 volt setup. It's fully charged as well. Uh, the crystal shard does not have a driver. Let's start it up here. This is a resistor. And that's the crystal shard saber is the one that's uh, making the noises there. I don't know what the blades look like. <clears throat> About the same. Um, blades are both my uh, clear uh, dual core diffusion style. They got about six feet of uh, film in each one of them. They're one inch. Modified blade tips. Both of them. Here's the main difference. I'm going to use brass saber number one. We'll do this. That's your white flash. And Lux V, obviously, that's not going to do that, so we're going to get out of that. Use your standard shimmer and flash. As far as brightness goes, and that's really what this was about, they are pretty much uh, on par. Uh, Actually, I was kind of expecting the uh, Tri Rebel to out, uh, outdo it, but uh, it doesn't look that way. Anyway, here we have a little comparison between the Luxion V and a Tri Rebel. So, as always, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time.